Today I wanted to show you guys the floor that we got installed throughout the home. We went with the Shaw Pantheon HD with the beveled edges in the honeycomb color. It was a toss up for us between the alabaster or the honeycomb color. We ultimately went with honeycomb because we wanted a little bit more warmth but still a light color. Now the alabaster is nice as well too but it's lighter and if you wanted something that's light and really opens up the space then the alabaster would be uh, that'll probably be the, be the go-to there but i've got a plank here you can see it's about a centimeter thick it's got this cushion down below beneath it to absorb the sounds as you walk and did i mention it's got a lifetime residential warranty as well which is nice um, it's also got some texture now you'll be able to see this better when I show you uh, the, the floors and then also the bevel edges is a lot more noticeable as well too. But it, the bevel edges and also the, the, the texture in the wood grains gives it a really real wood look and feel to it and we absolutely love it. So let me show you the floors here and let you see what, uh, what it looks like. And here it is installed on the floor. So you can see the wood grains on the planks. One of the concerns that I had when we were looking at this at the flooring store that it might not have enough wood grains or variations. I uh, personally, I like the wood grains. Um, wifey likes more of the consistency, but I feel like this is a balance between consistency and then wood grains as well. If you've uh, ever seen hickory floors, <laughs> that has a ton of uh, variations, some dark planks, some light planks, and it's a, it's a really unique look. But this one has the variations that I, I like, but then it's not too extreme like the, like the hickory. And then also here, I'll record me walking so you can hear it. Um, and that popping was actually my ankle, not the floor. So sorry about that. But um, besides that, you notice it was really quiet. And I, I attribute that to the... Um, cushion that was beneath the, the, the plank that I uh, showed you guys earlier. But really is a sound absorbent. And let me get a better angle so you can see the beveled edges on this. I have to uh, go over here. Ah, there we go. So you see, there are the beveled edges on the edge of the planks real, gives it a um, real wood feel to it and, and look to it, uh, as well as the, the texture. There's texture um, that follows the grains of the, uh, of the, of the planks, you see? The uh, texture, that also gives it a uh, real wood look and feel to it as well. And you see the beveled edges here. It's uh, really nice. And that's my real quick uh, presentation on the floors that we got installed. I hope you guys found it helpful. I know when I was looking online and trying to find pictures or videos, it was very hard to find anything. I found some pictures. I don't think I found any videos. And the pictures that I saw were just the, the floor, the, maybe it was the angle of the lighting, but it was just, it seemed like blended together. You didn't see the beveled edges and you didn't see the variations between the, the different planks. So I hope that this video helped you to determine if these floors will be a good fit for your home. If you don't like the honeycomb color, they have lighter ones, um, the alabaster, they even have like a gray color and then darker colors as well too. But again, it's got a lifetime warranty, residential warranty, and it's a floating plank. It's got that cushion so it absorbs the sound very well and um, water resistance too, so that's really nice. 
But if you guys have any questions, be sure to just shoot me a comment down below. I'll try to address them for you and help you guys out. And then also subscribe to our channel here and follow our build because we've got other projects lined up and I'll try to post them as we complete each project. So I'll just see you guys next time.